Hi everybody, this is Roxy, and I just wanted to share some cards I've made with the Folk Art Festival Cricut cartridge. I love this cartridge. It's um, a Scandinavian, I think it's actually Pennsylvania Dutch um, designs. Um, uh, you know, the, you see a lot of this, probably here in Minnesota especially because there's a lot of Scandinavians here. But that same kind of cutout design. But Pennsylvania Dutch in Pennsylvania, they've got definite designs like this so if I make any sense I don't know if I do I'm so excited about it but it's super cute and oh, they just got a tons of cuts all these have got farmhouses or barns church so it'd be really cute for Christmas to make like a little village scene or something windmill I thought I saw some people in here nope oh. But a lot of animals and, you know, like pineapple, apples, pears, really nice font. And, oh, here's some people. I thought so. There's some little people there. So you could really just mimic, and then there's cards. I haven't done any of the cards yet. I got a whole train for, like, a kid's room. Really cute. Um, but the you could really imitate a... Tea tall or you know they used to make calendars. I've got some. I'll um, dig them up and show you. Um, Cause I do want to make like a maybe like a a welcome sign for summer um, with these cuts. But they've even got just beautiful borders. So I kind of um, I just did some note cards. Okay, I'll start with this one. <laughs> and this is and I kind of pulled paper that kind of had 70s colors or so I to me they were 70s um, this is the uh, my mind's eye happier and I just think they're kind of they just seem real 70s to me the little design and stuff like an updated version okay and I just wanted to make the cuts I didn't do anything fancy um, so what I did I cut a border for each one. You can kind of not see it in the camera, I'm guessing. But it's just a little bit of a contrast. And here's the Miss Owl. And um, I just wrapped some twine around the back. It may be hard to see on the camera. I don't know if it is. Twine, button, border. Um, so that's that one. And these are like five minute cards again. If that, I mean, it just the time it takes to cut the um, designs out. There's horse, isn't that pretty? And that's my little horse in the background. There's a bunny. And what I did too is some of these, like this cut, the horse's um, swirl and his heart. I kept all those little pieces, like an anal little thing I am, because I thought that'd be cute to, you know add to some designs or whatever. And then the hedgehog, I did them all at about the same size and Miss Hedgehog came out too big, but it's still cute. Okay, so those are the my animal series. <laughs> and then this is with um, Blink and an Eye. These are real 70s colors. These kind of muted orange and um, blues kind of this brownish color yeah that's, that's total 70s color so I made a house I think that's cute and then this is a tulip border and then a star I love the star these would be, I mean, that'd be a really pretty Christmas star and sun for summer. And then I just use Lawn Fawn twine on this. Look at that heart, isn't it gorgeous? There's those. Then I use um, Crate Paper Farmhouse for some and more bolder 70s 
70s inspired. Like this is like total 70s for me. That's what it, to me it looks very 70s. These turquoise and orange and gold and avocado. And just kind of the floral patterns. I mean, I know I had a I know I had a dress made out of material like this with this dark background and all these old calicos like that just very very okay I gotta save my hen for last because I love her the best and here's a mushroom somebody's getting restless a quail which is I think they use the quail a lot in their design in Pennsylvania Touch. Isn't that pretty? I love the cutouts. And I used, I wanted to use a real contrast of colors so you could see the cutouts. They really pop out. There's an apple. And my little hen, I love her the best. Isn't she cute with her little scalloped little ruffle butt <laughs> her bottom? So there are the um, some of the cuts from the Pennsylvania Dutch. Well, pardon my mistake. The Pins Folk Art Festival. Where'd my cartridge go? Oh, there it is. So I am going to make a collage. Um, I I'm going to try to make one for a Christmas gift, like a welcome banner. Um, so we'll see how that goes. Uh, thanks for letting me share. Bye.